Hello everyone, it's Strawberry Ellie here and thank you so much for joining me in another video. Last week I was sharing with you what I'm taking with me in my small backpack to travel around the world and one thing I didn't show you in detail because I wanted to make a whole separate video about it and that's why we're here right now and in this video I want to share with you what I have in my small minimalist toiletries bag and why I say it is a minimalist toiletries bag that's because it is really simple and easy. There's not a lot of things in there. I keep it really simple just with my normal natural body care routine. I also filmed another separate video on that. If you're interested, I'm gonna link it down below. And I don't really use a lot of beauty products. That way I don't need a lot of time in the morning to get ready. And it's just really simple and easy and obviously it's really convenient with traveling so I can easily put that in my backpack and take it as my hand luggage and I don't have to check in my bag and yeah it's just really easy for me to travel that way and I really enjoy it so that's it here my small and light toiletries bag and before I go into detail what exactly I have in here I just want to say that there's only one rule that you have to think about before you can just use that as a hand luggage to so you don't have to check it in and that is the 311 rule so what that means is all the liquids you have in here they're not allowed to be more than three ounces or also 100 milliliters and the whole entire bag shouldn't be bigger than one liter so Everything fits in here perfectly. That's one liter Ziploc bag and why I have it in a Ziploc bag? I don't know. I think it's just really easy. I can just roll it together and it doesn't take up a lot of space. But another alternative for that is just what my boyfriend has and that's just this Eagle Creek toiletries pouch. And if you're interested, I can link you that down below as well. So I guess that's everything general I want to say about this minimalist toiletries bag. And now we just get into what I actually have in here. So now you see everything laid out and now I'm just going to explain every item real quick. So first we're going to start off with my toothbrush and I'm using a wooden toothbrush because I think it's way more eco-friendly than using a plastic one. And you can also just use a small one that you can fold together, which is really good for traveling. But I think the size of this one is perfect too. It's really small and light and it's perfect for me. Then as a toothpaste, I'm just using a natural vegan toothpaste with just a few ingredients. I just always make sure that it's fluoride free. And I also made my own toothpaste before by just using coconut oil, baking soda and some peppermint oil. But it's kind of hard to travel with that, so this will work too. Then I'm also using floss. Uh, I don't really like a particular brand, I just always make sure that it's unwaxed. And then for my nails, I have a nail clipper with me and this one also comes with a small file and yeah, that's really handy and convenient. I also have tweezers with me for any kind of reason to just make my eyebrows for example or anything like that. I think they're really essential and I always have them with me. And then I also have a razor with me just in case and yes, you can travel with that in your toiletries bag in your hand luggage so it definitely works and you have no complications then as my shampoo i'm just using a vegan shampoo that is really natural and it doesn't really have a strong smell it's not artificial and it also doesn't have any chemicals in it so really simple and easy and i have it in this 100 milliliter travel size container they are always really good for traveling for all kind of liquids. If you have creams, shampoos, conditioners, anything like that, I would suggest putting them into these ones. And then just in case, I also have a small sample of a dry shampoo. This one is from Lush because they don't test on other well. It's all cruelty free. And yeah, I just have that just in case if my hair gets a little bit greasy, for example, and I don't want to wash it, so I'm going to use a little bit of that, but I rarely use that ever. I just have that just in case with me. 
and last but not least Dr. Bonners. Now I mentioned Dr. Bonners in a lot of videos before and that's because I just love this product so much. It's just a mixture of essential oils, it has no chemicals in it, it's not tested on animals and it's really natural, really natural ingredients and I use it for so many different things. I use it to do my laundry or as a soap. You can also use it as a shampoo or shower gel. Just water it down with a few drops of water and then you have the perfect mixture to do so many things. So this travel size container lasts me quite a while and I always make sure to have it with me wherever I go. All right guys, and that's it for my toiletries bag. As you can see, it was pretty simple and easy and lightweight and that I don't really have a lot of things in there. Now, as I said, I keep it really simple and easy and I enjoy it that way. I don't really wear any makeup. I don't use any extra beauty products. I don't like to use anything that's really chemically based or tested on animals on my skin. I don't have any excess things. I don't use any conditioners or makeup, as I said, any creams, body lotions, anything like that. It's just really simple and easy. And I also found out that I don't really need a brush anymore. So that's why I haven't included that. It's, it's because I don't really travel with one. So my hair is in that way really easy and I can just do whatever I want with it and it stays that way so I don't use a brush either. But that's it, everything I wanted to share with you in this video, I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know what you need to have in your toiletries bag, I would love to hear yeah, what you like to travel with and other than that, I hope you enjoyed watching this video, I hope you have an amazing day and I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys! <laughs>